The purpose of methods engineering is to create an optimal work method. This is usually called work improvement. For example, closely examine the motion of the hands of a worker doing some kind of work. Thereupon, you would discover the following points as a result. From these motions, remove or omit unnecessary motions, conventionally performed by rearranging the placement of jigs and integrating two actions into one action by using both hands to modify it at once into an optimal work method. In this case, the travel distance of the right and left hands is reduced from 7.5 meters to 2 meters, and the time spent on the process was reduced from 18 seconds to 6 seconds. IE is a collection of techniques used in such a process that can help you visualize the work, in this example, into figures and charts, as well as thinking about improvement measures. You may be wondering how we came up with these ideas for improvement. The attitude known as motion mind is important. While improving the current status, it is always necessary to see and think analytically and logically. When seeing and thinking analytically, it is important to do it accurately, quantitatively, and distinctively. Gilbreth broke down the entire bricklaying work into 18 motions. Seeing and thinking analytically refers to reviewing procedures with meticulous detail. By doing so, you can find unnecessary motions Seeing and thinking logically refers to the pursuit of original purpose, functionality, and values. For example, break down the assembly of bolts and washers and check if each motion is directly related to the original purpose of the work. Motions that are not directly related to the purpose can be omitted through innovation. Seeing and thinking efficiently means eliminating unnecessary motions in this way.